guys, this is you. Welcome back to a mod spotlight. So for some reason, Minecraft won't update my skin back to what my old one was, and I'm just stuck with this like freaky, straight bang, hair malfunction thing that I haven't quite fixed yet. Cause I really like this like awesome sunset colored hair, but the straight bang, it's not cute. So I'm gonna keep this hair head a helmet on because uh hair malfunctioned. Also, why is it dark? <music> Alright guys, so the sun has come back out and we are going to do another mod spotlight. So, the mod spotlight we're going to do today is the hamsterific mod. Now everybody and their mother has done this mod spotlight and I don't care. Because it's adorable and it's also something really small and cute that we can do really easily. So basically what it is, is randomly in the world, I believe anywhere that passive mods spawn, these little guys will spawn and these are the little hamsters and they're very very cute they're very small they're really hard to miss and they cannot go up a block but they can fall down them as much as they want so you gotta have to be careful um because they do fall into pools of water and then conveniently can't get out so yeah to tame one if you were to catch one you just create some hamster food and by doing this you're gonna just need some seeds you're gonna need some seds some regular seeds, some pumpkin seeds, and some melon seeds. And you can just make it in a 4x4 little crafting table like this. Put them all together, get hamster food. Pretty great. But you go up to them, and then they're pretty cute. You just kind of... Oh! You made a little clicking noise. It's very loud. Um, it scares me every time I do it. I don't know if he's ours or not. Yeah, he is. So when you feed them too much, or they're already tamed, little... No block sound will come up, but their cheeks will continue to puff up. You can see his little cheeks are all puffied up because of, um, we fed him, so he's storing all his food in his cheekies. Now, once you actually have him and he's tamed, you can go on and click on him with a piece of paper, and now he's on your head, and this is how you can transport him around. But be careful, because if you watch Wondercraft, you know that they fall off very easily. You can't go into water that's deeper than two blocks or they'll fall off. You can't bump into a tree like if you were to walk under a tree and the leaves would like go right over your head. They'd fall off and never be seen again. If these things fall, if they do end up falling off your head, you're never going to see them again. They disappear into oblivion. So be very careful when transporting your little hamster. Now to get him off, his, off your head, all you do is right click on him. They fall to the ground. They're very cute. To uh... Yeah, so, and they also, the mod also has these hamster balls, they come in every color, and, uh, I'm gonna turn shaders off, because you can't see them already as it is, and with shaders on, they just become non-existent, and, uh, yeah, you can let them run around in the ball, and I'm trying to get them to go on, one little hamster, run your ball, because the ball actually spins, it's very cool, come here, stop that, stop that cute thing, stop that cute thing, would you just come here? Yeah, see, there's the ball that's rolling. And to get them out, you just right click on them with paper. The balls are a bit glitchy when you put them in uh, here. Let me show you. See, I've got one ball in my hand right now. If I click on it, I still have the one ball in my hand, but they also appear in the ball. And when I right click them, I still have the one ball in my hand. So they're a bit glitchy, but you know, it all works out in the end. And, uh, and yeah, they're just like the most adorable thing. Of course, you can name them with name tags. No, don't fall. Don't fall. No. No, let me just grab a name tag really quick. Get an anvil. Just grab 64 because I'm a lazy person. Need a name tag. And we're gonna name this one uh, June. Oh, wait, let me go into creative mode. Juniper. That way I have five XP levels. Come here, Juniper. So cute. But yeah, these. Uh, this is a really adorable mod. I definitely. I definitely recommend it if you're into animals and you love little animals and you think that they're all so cute and fluffy because they are and this mod is just one of my favorites even though I don't I really just wish there was like a clear like a, like a glass texture hamster ball but whatever let's give you puff those cheeks up so cute so yeah I'm gonna spawn in a ton of hamsters now and uh, roll the end credits Whee! Hamsters! Woo! Yay! Alright 
right guys thank you so much for watching and i'll see you next time hopefully with a better hairdo because this is not cute girl Today's video is sponsored by No Scope Glasses. If you follow the link in the description, you get yourself a pair of high quality glasses for 20 bucks and you get to help out the show. Thanks so much.